It's a math guy, Steve. Let's try solving this equation. All right, so how we solve this equation is first, um, we isolate the radical. So here, the radical is already on the side by itself. And so uh, then we raise both sides to some power. In this case, we would square both sides, okay? So in squaring both sides, we get, okay, x squared equals, and then squaring the right-hand side, we get two minus x, okay? Now it's a quadratic, so we get zero on one side, factor the other side, set each factor equal to zero. So um, that would give us what? x squared, if we add x, so plus x, subtract two, equals zero. And now I'll try factoring the other side. It's three terms. There's a one in front. So double bubble x and x. And then notice that multiply give me negative two and add to give me this positive one. So that would be positive two and negative one. Okay. So we got zero on one side. We factor the other side. Now set each factor equal to zero. So x plus two equals zero and x minus one equals zero. So x equals negative two and x equals positive one. And that would be our solutions. However, since it's a radical equation, we have to check it, okay, to make sure we don't have any extraneous solutions. Okay, let's check it. All right, so how do we check? We plug it back into the original, see if we get a true statement. Okay, so if I plug in negative 2, let's see what we get. Is negative 2, is that equal to the square root of 2 minus negative 2? All right, well, is negative 2, is that equal to the square root of 2 minus negative 2 is 4? Is this true? Well, this is a positive square root. So negative 2 is that equal to the positive square root of four is two. Is this true? No, this is not true. So negative two is not a solution to this equation. All right, let's check one. All right, so plugging in one, we would get one. Is that equal to the square root of two minus one? Is this true? Well, one is that equal to, again, this is a positive square root. So uh, positive two minus one is one. The square root of one, is this true? Yeah, one equals one. Okay, so this one checks out. So the only solution here we have is x equals one. Always remember math is everywhere.